Today we are going to review the newest ATV, which is called Envix. Let's go! Hi there, as usual it's me, just a voice over, you are watching the view machines and these are all-terrain vehicles Envix. If you look closer at these machines, you will be able to notice that they look like huge quads. And for the most part, they are really huge quads, but for some significant moments. The idea of the project is to make fast, comfortable and capable at off-roading machines, good both for short rides and for long expeditions. Today we are going as usually to examine the construction and make some exciting tests. So it's going to be an interesting day. Take your seats in our ATVs. We are to start right now. Today we have two models. The one without cabin is called Envix Start, and yellow machine with cabin is called Ultimate. Their prices differ greatly. But we'll speak a bit later about the prices and now let's review the Ultimate version. As I said, the design of the machine resembles a huge quad. The rider position is like on the usual quad. But as we can see, we have here a spacious cabin. And I barely can call the thing a quad. There are even bars inside the cabin, I'll show you them later. The length is 3315 mm, the width is about 2500 mm, the height is 2900 mm. The base here is an advanced frame that provides 1000 kg carrying capacity. The weight of the vehicle is 1190 kg. The ATV is equipped with Toyota engine. It's 1.8 liters capacity, 145 HP. It works together with automatic gearbox Toyota Aizen. There are low pressure huge wheels, 1300 mm diameter. They have bed locks and cranes for fast inflation. The ground clearance with these wheels are 570 mm. There are axles from 4x4 vehicle with electric differential lock. The great feature of these machines the advanced suspension system. Together with low pressure wheels, it provides a very smooth riding. Besides, for additional comfort, there is an electric power steering. The vehicle is equipped with anti-roll cage covered with flexible material. The front winch is integrated into the body. There are many powerful lights and trunks mounted on the body. Let's look what we have inside. The rider position and the handlebar are like on the quad. The throttle is at the right, gear shifting is at the left. So the steering is very simple. Besides, we see here numerous indicators. It's good that all they have clear icons. Then we see here a multimedia system and a big display behind the handlebar. It's waterproof, with navigation, music and so on. Two speakers are also waterproof. There is a huge seat from behind. We have here plenty of room. Four people can sit here. By the way, it can be transformed into a flat platform, providing comfortable sleeping bars. The cheaper model also has such a feature, though the seat here is not so comfortable as we can see. After a short ride, I can tell you about several interesting moments. The first one. It's so comfortable steering. Besides, the large vehicle reacts to the throttle very swiftly, as if it was a little lightweight quad. Then I like how smoothly it goes on rough terrain. 
In fact, many other ATVs with low pressure wheels are not equipped with any suspension. But here we have both soft wheels and advanced suspension. As a result, this ATV goes like a vessel across steel water. The rider's seat is rather high from the ground, so the field of view is perfect. And it's time to go off-roading. But before that, let's look how they build these machines. Before the production, the design of all the parts is thoroughly developed in 3D modeling software. They use the most contemporary technologies to make the details of this machine, from 3D printers to the lasers. As a result, the design is very neat and qualitative. Now you see the frame. It's completely developed from scratch, specially for this project. By the way, the suspension system allows to use various types of wheels, with diameter up to 1400 mm. Well, all this stuff is interesting, but it's even more interesting to see what this machine is capable of. Let's go! The speed is one of the advantages of this ATV. On a flat road it can accelerate up to 80 km per hour. And that is a good speed for an ATV. Unfortunately, we don't have a proper road nearby. But even on rough terrain we could accelerate more than 40 km per hour. And the suspension meantime provides a perfect control even at a such speed. Let's leave a good road for some interesting obstacles. For example, huge ground clearance allows to cross such ditches without any problems. But frankly speaking, I think there is a drawback in the transmission. As we remember, it's automatic, but I think a real off-roader should be equipped with a mechanical gearbox working together with a transfer case. On the other hand, Toyota transmission is very durable and it shows good result in practice. Then we tested our vehicles on swamps. And there is every reason to say that they are cut out for such conditions. Low pressure wheels, plenty of smooth torque of automatic transmission, diff locks provide the best performance in a swamp. Actually, we can go wherever we want. But as opposed to any quad with comfort, cabin and sleeping bars. That is a key feature for long travels. By the way, the range of the ATV is almost 500 km. So we can make a really distant travels with this machine. Moreover, in fact, Envix is an amphibious vehicle. It's able to float and can move on water at a speed 6 km per hour that allows to cross any obstacles with steel water. But as a matter of fact, any ATV can get stuck. For example, it was a thrilling moment when we tried to cross this ditch. Let's watch the show. Finally, we had to change our way a little bit to get out from this trap. And now it's high time to speak about the prices. There are numerous additional options, and the final price will significantly depend on the set of options. 
but the standard price starts from $15,000. Well, let's call it a day, my friends. Thanks for having a ride with us. Please post your comments what you think of this machine. Consider subscribing the channel if you liked this video. Stay with us, there will be many more interesting materials here. Goodbye.